Hello my people, this is your redneck from Cali Nate. We're going to do another episode of What's in the Box. <laughs> um, ironically, the last video that just went up um, today was from a couple days ago um, from a hunt I did. But we did get some stuff in the mail today and yesterday. Um, and I kind of wanted to do these separately um, because I got some great stuff in from some great friends. So wanted to do it separately for my brothers. All right. Now, first up, got up a knife. And we got a packaging from Entertainment Earth. So let's show you what they sent Nate. All right. Now they, they've had these on order for a little bit. Uh, so of course I had to go. And the thing is, Entertainment Earth is in California, so I do a lot through them for retail stuff. Um, what we got in was a, you can tell, Power Dasher Zeta. This, of course, is a Generation Select version of it. And we're going to go on and open it so I can show you what's in the box. And this is how it looks. So it is, a, of course, a recolor, remold from Brunt uh, from earlier done this year. So definitely wanted to get it. Um, I have the Nightbird on order as well. So as soon as it gets here, I'll definitely show you guys. All right. But at least we got Zatar or Zeta. Zeta R. There we go. Zeta R. Now, the rest of these boxes, uh, hold on. let's go with this one. So this one is courtesy of the Transformers Game Group. Um, this is from Ruth K, so RK, thank you so much, I appreciate it, man. Um, I won this from him, and let's see what's in the box. I like how it says, Fragile on the box. All right. I've never had this figure ever in my collection. Uh, I know there's a new version of it coming out, but it was cool to win this one. I'll tell you that. First up, it came with it is a canister, and I'll show you what that's for here in a minute. Uh, but what we actually won was Bad Cube Brawny. This, of course, the demolitions version of it. Um, I don't know if this is the original or the 2.0, but I, I know it was nice to finally get it. Um, so, thank you, Riff. I appreciate it. And let me show you what's in this little canister. So this is called, you know, of course, the Quintesson Journal. All you old Transformers head knows what this is. What it is is an accessory kit for both um, Brawny and Outback. And it's cool because it comes with a scope rifle. An antenna dish. And... Comes with a torch. Comes with an alternate face for Brawny. I know it's hard to see it. And then an alternate face for Outback. So kind of cool to get all that in that little bitty accessory pack. So again, Rith, thank you so much. I appreciate it, man. I'm gonna put them all back in here so I don't lose none of the pieces. And it is cool. I like this little canister. That is cool. So thank you. All right. So next box we got courtesy of my boy Slim Tim reviews Tim Risdale. Me and him had a trade. If you guys remember a while back, I ended up getting him a uh, Star Wars game set, and he found something for me up there in the Great White North. So thank you, and I always appreciate my brothers. You know him and. Donald Wood and Sylvain, you know, from Canada, because they really look out for me up there, and I appreciate it, um, because a lot of times they get stuff, even before we do, 
you know, and I get stuff pretty fast here in California. You know, it's just based upon the timing of it, you know, they get it first a lot of the time. And it's no different than what this guy is. So, what we got in is Siege, War for Cybertron, Autobot Ratchet. Ratchet is a Walgreens exclusive, but it can't, already came out at EB Games up in Canada. So, um, and I asked Tim, I said, hey, if you can find it at EB Games, can you, can you get it for me? And he was able to do that. So, thank you, Tim. I appreciate it. All right, the last box is a big box. This is courtesy of my boy, Dondi, um, a.k.a. the Toy Don from Life Anime Gaming. Um, go check out his channel down below. Um, we're, I'm part of a group with him and some other guys in there, like the Tattoo Toy Hunter, Babyface Collects, uh, Louis Toy World, Tim. I mean, there's a lot of people. And me and him had a, had a trade. Um, and I sent him stuff a while back. And he said, hey, I gotta, I'm got getting you a bunch of stuff to send in here. So... I said, take your time. I am in no big hurry. You know, when it gets here, it gets here. All right, let's see. We got paper, paper, paper. Ha, that is cool. That's a um, Dakonga. Looks like. That is cool. So, if you guys don't know what these are, these are typically at um, Tuesday morning. Usually, these are done by Polyfect Toys. They actually do some KOs of G1 Transformers, Robot Masters. They do um, um, these as well. Qu you know, this is part of their Quick Change line. Um, this is awesome. This is like a Diaclone mixed with a with a Mecha. I like that. And he knows me. I love robots. So, and it's cool because like actually the actual instructions are on the back of the box of the packaging. That is awesome. I'm gonna have fun with this one. Thank you, Don. All right. And we got Kid Boo from Dragon Stars. This, of course, there isn't one for SH Fig Words yet. Um, so it's cool to get this one. So thank you, Dondi. And let's see. He sent me. Yeah, buddy. I needed this one. Uh, Infinity War Thor. This, of course, is going to go with my Marvel Legends set up there. Um, since we don't have the in game Thor yet, this would be a good pseudo sit in until then. Um, so thank you. I appreciate it, man. Because you got to have Thor with your with your Infinity War in games. You just got it. That's just the rules. That's the rules. And then... Ooh! We got some comics. You guys know I love me some comics. Alright. First up we got... Avengers Academy 21. Uh, let's see, we got G.I. Joe, Real American Hero, Weapons and Text, Battle Files. We got Thor, Wolves of the North. It's a one shot, number one. We have, ooh, Captain Marvel, number one. We got, this is uh, cool. Who did this? Freddie Williams the third, did, or the second did this one. He-Man and Thundercats, number four. Oh yeah, I remember this one. I had this comic a long time ago. Avengers 366. This is the uh, 30th anniversary time. I want to say this is from, yeah, 93. Yeah. That is freaking awesome. And it's got a gold cover on it. It's embossed. They don't make books like that no more. We got um, 
Mutant X number 19. If you guys don't know what Mutant X was, it's where Havoc got put into an alternate dimension. He was corrupted over there. Um, and then he figures out, you know, it's all not as it's supposed to be and he wants to come home. Um, and then we got Uncanny X-Men 394. Of course, this is Maggot. Yep. I think this is actually the first appearance of Maggot, actually. I'll have to look, but I think it is. Yeah, the old Scopdell, uh, Chris Bacolo days. So, Dondi, thank you so much, brother. You didn't have to do all this. You did not have to send all the extra things. I really appreciate it, man. Um, again, I want to say a big shout-out to um, Transformers Gang Group Rith for the uh, Brawny, as well as my boy Tim Risdale for the Ratchet. And of course, Dondi, thank you so much. And Entertainment Earth, thank you guys for getting this out to me pretty fast. I mean, this literally I wasn't supposed to come out until like next month sometime, and they already sent it to me. So it's been an awesome day and an awesome haul, people. Thank you, each and every one of you. I appreciate you. Um, if it's the first time on my channel, like this video. And if you like my content, hit that subscribe button, you know. And if, if you want to see this more often, hit that notification bell. So. That's it for today's haul, guys. Hope you guys take it easy and have a good one. I'll see you on the next one. All right, all right, all right.